Welcome back everybody to another Royale Master video of Apex Legends. Today we've got all kinds of shenanigans for you, from Gibraltars dancing around their domes to clutch mirage ults and more. Sit back, relax, and enjoy today's clips. There's something incredibly impressive about this next play, and maybe a few things impressive about it actually. Let's take a look as perfect use of character abilities and positioning secures a really tight win. When you come under fire, it can be easy to get stressed out and start jumping around erratically. Just don't panic your way off the map like this next player. There are a few things going on in this next clip, not the least of which is a player who looks like he's trying to fly away with the death box. But maybe more impressive are those Kraber shots. That is what I like to see. Wow! Even when comparing to just other Battle Royale games, Apex Legends is a fast-paced game, and looking away for a split second could be your undoing. Hey, what happened? When used correctly, which is to say in a variety of ways, Mirage's ult can be a powerful and sneaky tool. Watch as this next player gets an invisible bamboozle and turns it into a triple kill. Having said that, I don't know if I'm confident enough that I would have scoped all the way in on those up close longbow shots. For a game whose ping system quickly inspired other games to follow suit, there's a lot of options for nonverbal communication in Apex Legends. Even so, that doesn't stop a silent argument from breaking out from time to time. In this next clip, we watch a Mirage use his positioning carefully to surprise and outflank an enemy team. Let's take a look as the R99 and Longbow put in some work on this next clip. While the EVA 8 was never anything to laugh at, it always has played second fiddle to the Peacekeeper. Nowadays though, people are finding there's plenty to love about this full auto shotgun. Take a look at what this next player does with it. If I've said it once, I've said it a hundred times, the triple take is nothing to scoff at. Let's take a look as it helps this next player secure a whole lot of kills. Never leave a man or woman behind. That's probably what's going through this Pathfinder's mind as he trudges through a slew of enemy players rather than flanking around them to recover his teammates' banner. Well done. The Peacekeeper can be the king of making every shot count, delivering massive damage with each pull of the trigger. In this next clip, we watch an Octane put it to good use. Side note, why does it seem like it's harder to hit downed enemy players crawling than those running around at full speed? Down that one. 
In this next clip, we get a glimpse of an early game engage from a Pathfinder, who appears to never break a sweat when it comes to positioning, target acquisition, or aim tracking. Let's take a look. If there's anything that team-based games like Battle Royales and other team shooters have taught us, it's that trickling in one by one is usually not the most effective way to win a fight. Something this next squad may want to think about before they end up on the wrong side of another highlight. While Gibraltar hasn't always been the most popular legend to play in Apex, he's come into his own. And sometimes, these clips that can highlight clever play around his dome and other abilities make a good case for why more people might want to play him. In an impressive final fight, this next Wraith demonstrates why vertical superiority and getting your positioning right can really help you set things up well. Also, later on here in the clip, she makes a really good case for why you want to have some grenades and arc stars on you going into that final push. In this next clip, everything seems to work out for our player in the end. But remember, prioritize what you loot. It might have been a good idea for him to pick up that light ammo ASAP after he'd emptied his alternator. We've seen a few clips of people hitting clutch, long-range Mozambique shots that end up dealing just enough damage to finish off a player. Unfortunately for the victim of this next clip, his Mozambique play didn't earn him a kill. Sometimes, a firefight just doesn't take any longer than it needs to. 
as in this next clip, where a lifeline gives a quick end to an enemy team with the longbow and the R301. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button on this video and hit subscribe if you've enjoyed our content. We'll see you in the next one.